Good evening, everybody. So the first question I, I plan to answer is the question of what skills are needed in a competitive job market and how to acquire those skills. Considering that I'm a Bangladeshi Jamai, it only makes sense that I do the answers within that context of Bangladesh. Now, firstly, there are nearly 50,000 professional skills in the world. Logically, none of us have the ability to learn 50,000 skills. So each of us have to go and identify those specific skills that are needed for my or your specific industry or area of interest. <clears throat> skills can be broken down into broadly two different categories. We have hard skills and soft skills. Hard skills are very job related, industry related, where soft skills can cut across multiple industries and multiple jobs because those are the skills that make us human and differentiate us in an era of automation and AI. The top hard skills for Bangladesh in the right now and the immediate future. Selling skills, believe it or not, although we have so many salespeople in Bangladesh, there are very few with actual real selling skills. Selling is a science, it's not just going around taking orders. So the way to acquire that is to find a job where you have a coach that can coach you on the job in the proper selling skills and the science of that selling for you to learn from someone who knows what he's doing. Secondly, you can take courses, online courses, uh, night courses, after hour courses, weekend courses that teaches you the, the science of selling. Selling is a competitive environment and although there are lots of sales jobs, there are lots of people available in the role and as such there is a need to develop that skill. Then sales leadership. Yes, sales leadership is a very, very desperate need for in Bangladesh at the moment. Sales leadership is not just about the ability to exercise pressure and get people to achieve targets. Sales leadership comes with a combination of understanding data, interpreting data and how to turn that data into actions with which to drive and move your sales forces on the ground to achieve the desired results. But also it is about being able to maintain high energy teams and motivation throughout this process. Data analytics. I face this on a day-to-day, -day, very regular basis, the need for data analysis. Because unfortunately we have many sales and for that matter many leaders who don't have the ability to understand data, interpret data. We need the skills for those people who can look at data at 360 degrees, interpret that and turn that into action items for the industry with which to impact performance. There are courses to be taken to, uh, to advance yourself in Excel skills plus skills on analytical thinking and, and, uh, and analytical uh, processes with which to turn information into workable data. Digital and social media marketing. The time of TV and newspaper will end. So those people who are able to take products to market on digital platforms and on social media like Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat will be very employable within the coming years. And that is a skill that you can learn online, courses are available, services are available where you can learn this skill. Process engineers, very important. Bangladesh needs to find ways with which to optimize processes that we currently use in industry, chemical, etc. with which to keep ourselves competitive as well make us profitable for investors. For those, you need to go get professional qualifications. You also have to focus on your ability, your math skills, your analytical ability. And then more importantly, you have to get yourself into jobs where you can build experience within that industry that you are in. Without the experience, just the qualifications is not, not enough. On the soft skills side, some very basics we all need. Creativity in problem solving. The ability to solve problems in a creative new way. Teamwork. We must all learn how to follow and how to lead. That is what teamwork is all about. Time management. I cannot stress this enough, especially for Bangladesh. If we can master time management, it's a skill that is valuable right now and will serve you for the rest of your career. Adaptability. Very important because environment will change. It's going to change a lot in the coming years and those who are able to adapt are the ones who will be able to survive. Then lastly but not the least is tenacity, grit, that ability that when things get tough, when things get difficult to, to keep at it and keep driving and not give up and run away. If you do not develop the ability to be uh, of tenacity, 
you will change jobs every once in a while and that will be very bad for your, for your brand and for your reputation. Thank you for your time and I appreciate you listening to me and I really hope that you find this helpful.